My passion has always been to photograph birds in their natural environment with an artistic approach. However, I have not filmed certain species on video at all. The last time I photographed rock ptarmigan and willow ptarmigan was more than 10 years ago. Would I be able to film these species this autumn? I had less than a week to look for these birds. Lapland is a kind of place where you travel with a certain expectations, but come back as a different person. When you're walking in a wilderness and taking photographs, you realize that you can't take everything for granted. The trouble started right from the start, though. My car broke down, but I was able to continue my journey in a rental car. However, I made it to Lapland and I was happy about it. I knew it would be difficult to find rock bottom again, although there must be at least two flocks of them in the area. There was no sign of a single bird. I took a one day break decided to go for a plan B and shoot completely different film just in case. I had some ideas from the previous trip so I wouldn't have to go south empty-handed. I wanted to express the emotions that come with being here in Lapland. I truly believe that getting out into nature we gain artistic inspiration. The next day in the fells should be beautiful weather. Well, there was no reason to climb to the top of the fell. Is it worth hanging on to your dreams? 
Does it stop you from seeing the beauty of the present? When I climbed to the top of the fell again, a winter wonderland was waiting for me. Every single plant had been glazed over. If that didn't inspire me, nothing would. I had never experienced anything like this. The wind was so cold that I couldn't spend the whole day there. I had to give up on the rock ptarmigan, but there was still hope of finding a willow ptarmigan. But I have to say, although I couldn't find the target species, despite my hard efforts, I believe that spending more time in the peace and quiet of nature, we can experience something unique and pass on our well-being to others. Lapland really does change people. When I started driving back south, it started snowing and the winter came to Finland. I still had problems with my car, but I finally made it home. Thank you.